Taurus, namaste. Thank you for clicking on the video. Please like, share, leave a comment below. Subscribe, because it helps me. Taurus, how are we? Hope everyone's well. Transcendence, 36, goddess. All right, Taurus. There's some leveling up happening. Goddess, 36. Hit that subscribe, please, guys. I noticed there's like 70% of people watching my stuff that, that aren't even subscribed. It helps me a lot if you subscribe, and it's not much effort. Thank you. So the goddess, heaven on earth, transcendence, karmic purpose. Okay, so it's going to do with something karmic. The feminine aspect of the divine, the goddess is the holy dwelling place for the soul. The mother's embrace can be felt in both her heavenly and earthly domains of Banar and Malkuth on the Kabbalistic tree of life. Many mystical tra traditions consider the union of divine lord and lady as essential transcendent bliss. Of course. Could be seeing swans. Could be seeing a lot of swans. Our Lady, the Goddess Queen of the Stars, shines her radiance upon you as one of her children. You are traveling the universe, fulfilling the dreams of creation. What is your dream? What do you wish for? To find one's sole purpose is the quest. How does this quest fit into the myths and legends of your land? Transcend all limitations in the messages of this card. To rise above earthly restrictions if one is feeling heavy or touch the earth if one is feeling confused and alone. Turn the Goddess for illumination and guidance. Seek the company of those who are wise. Have the faith to find yourself and enjoy your earthly life and follow your dream. Dreams. dreams can dreams can come true okay you're not alone you are not alone so this is all about your dreams and direction okay <laughs> ten of cups straight up taurus ten of cups is great joy pleasure of life a happy family peace contentment ecstasy a full heart being loved and cared for wow 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 so we've gone from the ten to the five Regret, limited loss, bereavement, inheritance not anticipated, superficial, disappointing relationships, difficult marriage, lacking love, bitterness, spoiling good things, possible new start. Okay, <clears throat> so we've gone from an ending to possibly a new start. Yeah, wow. And then the star, Aquarius energy. We'll be dealing with an Aquarius that's coming in. Now we've got seven stars there. Seven could be significant. Comment below if you know who this, who this actor is and what character it is. But the star, hope lights the way to a better future. Yeah, okay. So it's like, it's like there's, you thought something was good and then you realized it wasn't. So I, I feel like this, is, this has enlightened you. A new dawn's coming. Yeah, wow. Hope lights the way to a better future. Believe in your talents and follow your star. Don't give up the first hurdle. Don't give up at the first hurdle. Success may be just around the corner. Wow, guys. And that's this new beginning for you guys. That's transcending. You're transcending into the star. That's absolutely crazy, guys. Yeah, wow. The magician. Card number one. Um, comment below if you know the actor. Yeah. Good movie, that one. But there's this, uh, the past. Like, I felt like... So the magician is talented, a fast thinker, smooth talker with prime physical abilities. Top skills that you make money and the power to reach people's feelings complete your aces. Yeah, wow. So you've got, I feel like this, you could you could have been dealing with a water sign in the past. Or you could still be dealing with a water sign. And maybe this air sign that's coming in for you guys. Yeah? Oh, wow. Wheel of Fortune. Comment below if you know the actor in the movie. Yeah, I feel like this 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 speaking your truth. Because look, he's hold, it looks like he's holding uh, it's a power cord. But it looks like it looks like the microphone from the star. So I feel like whoever this whoever 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 you were dealing with in the past will quite well be your karmic partner. It'd be very karmic. Eight of Wands under the star messages. Things are coming in fast for you guys, Taurus. Things are coming in very fast for you. Um, you check your placements where your other star signs are, but like there's just these things that are just coming in for you, okay? And, and it's below the star. Progress, breakthrough, events moving quickly. Yeah, there we go. It's Wheel of Fortune. I feel like this. I feel like you're sitting in your power after this past loss. And and I feel like you understand what this what this previous connection was. And I feel like it it's 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 catapulted you into this into this knowing of which direction you want to go. Ace of coins. Look at that. I got the sun in the background. Coin. The magician. So this past energy, I feel like I feel like this Ace of Coins is, is your energy. I feel like this being in this previous situation that you were in and realizing realizing it was karmic, 
I feel like this this uh, this ace of coins is like that's the magician. He's got all the aces, right? And then I feel like the focus here for you in the past was money. We have the four of coins by the wheel of fortune. Inheritance, gift, win, grant, a benefit, status through wealth, financial protection and security, insurance. Okay, but that's because your wheel is turning. 10, look at that, it's on It's on the number 10. Now we got the 10, 10 of cups, wheel of fortune is number 10. There's this, this, this endings and beginnings here, guys. And I feel like everything's happening really, really quickly for you. Seven of swords, like the eight of wands. This to me is telling me that you need to ground, you need to ground your ideas, whether you need to go backwards or you need to go forwards. I feel like whatever you're manifesting and bringing down to ground, bringing it into reality, Taurus, you need to trust it. You really need to trust it. So on the top, on the top, we got the hermit that's going with them. That's the energy that you're, that's the energy that you're, that you, that you can see coming, coming in towards you. And on the bottom, we have the seven of coins, which is profit, growth, and progress, valuable assets, fruits of labor, hard, tall, on a learning curve, anxiety around money, potential for improved status or work promotion. And that's literally because you've gone within. You've gone within the dark night of the void. I feel like this this previous person was very, uh, wasn't, wasn't, I'm not going to say very karmic, but karmic, okay? And I feel like they've taught you a lot. They've taught you a lot. And this is all about growth and transcending. This is like rise, rise, Taurus. Wow, this is, this is amazing. You guys, leave a comment below if you're he's he's dealing with um, queries. You know, if there's new beginnings and you st like, I feel like there's a lot of opportunities coming in for you, Taurus, or like a lot of opportunities. But I feel like you need to let your wheel turn, okay? You need to trust them where you're going and what you're doing and you need to let things, you need to let things fall away and you need to let things come in at the same time. Like it, it's, it's this balance, you know, it's this ultimate balance. And I feel like going within and understanding what makes you happy is going to bring a lot of clarity for you and you'll be able to ground a lot of these ideas that you're coming up with Taurus okay which can bring you in money all right but there's something that you need to go go within and, and evolve Taurus love you guys hope this helps leave a comment below any of the characters you can recognize let me know if you know any of them there's some good movies here. love you guys so so much stay real stay healthy stay blessed and I'll see you in the next one Wow.